Hello everybody, welcome back to In Your Face Studios. In this episode, as you can see from the thumbnail, we are going to LA Comic Con. That's right, Los Angeles Comic Con, located in downtown Los Angeles. As usual, the people in charge there are crazy enough to invite me to be a guest. So I'm going to be a guest, I'll be there, I'll be sketching, um, you know, uh, doing commissions, drawing sketch covers, selling sketch cards, uh, my own comic book, uh, trying to get people to subscribe to this channel. Like, if you haven't already, I hope you do. It's about 8.30 in the morning. Uh, the show doesn't start till 4, but we got to get there, we got to set up. Um, and then we are going to spend Friday, Saturday, and Sunday at LA Comic Con saying hi to a lot of people there hopefully um, yeah it's gonna be a fun ride I'm just waking up as you can tell um, well I'm not just woken up I'm, I'm nice and dressed <laughs> but anyway so let's see how this goes all right it's gonna be different than last year's because you already know you've watched that you can watch the previous video of how I get ready for a show this is just gonna be the show we're gonna try and do it all in one video I'll try to keep it as short as possible Let's go. And there is all the stuff that it takes for me to do a show. All there, and it just has to get put in the car, and then we're off. Of course, you gotta have some pretzels. All right, we are packed, we are ready to go. And when I say we, it's because, like I'm gonna go full extension here. Ambrose is here. Look yeah. how far we are, <clears throat> look how far we are. Yeah. <laughs> it's like a crane, he's coming in for the close up. <laughs> <clears throat> anyway, um, let me get the sun in our face so you can see us. So we are packed, we're ready to go. Now it's about an hour, hour and a half drive to downtown LA, maybe a few stops here and there, but downtown LA for LA Comic Con. Woo! Usually I stop here after the show, but this time we're gonna stop before we even set up, grab some sandwiches and eat them in the convention center. All right, let's go inside and get our sandwiches. Mmm, I love these French dips. Still weird seeing just one line. I'm used to having several lines, but this is cool too. No one gets mad about people cutting in front of them. I have obtained the sandwiches. This is going to be hard not to eat it right now. There it is. Everything is ready to wheel in. I like to make one trip. And um, hey, nothing happened to my leg this year. Yeah. Remember last year I hit my, I, this cart, that cart when I opened up the back of the car fell and hit me right in the shin. You can still see the, the mark right there. Yep. No accidents this time. I was very careful. So as you can see, I already know when the date's going to be for next year. So see you next year, December 1st through the 3rd, 2023. So mark your calendars now. And this is about the emptiest you'll see this place. It's going to get so packed. The show just keeps more and more popular every year. Empty, empty. Hey, there's Daniel. Whoa, almost tripped. I got them on video. Did you see I almost tripped? I almost tripped. It's weird, it looks empty. We're here, we got our food, and we're joined by Daniel and Christina. <laughs> <laughs> That's what he called them on the he goes, it's just it's just me and Christina, so and I'm like, damn. I can understand if he got Scott confused with one of the one of the boys. We gotta confuse the girl. That's messed up. Well, now we know who's important to him. It 
Right, Scott? We know his pri where his priorities are. Man, who the favorite child is. Hey, go to the bathroom so you can come eat your sandwich. All right. We'll, we'll, we'll record you walking all the way down there. The long walk. I'm eating my sandwich. And, look, <laughs> Daniel's favorite Gross. hot mustard. Gross. And you don't like this mustard either, that right? Disgusting. Yeah. <laughs> I love this mustard. And it wasn't even like, at least, at least, Scott had a reason. He said it tastes like, uh, what did you say, cleaning fluid or something? Chemicals. Chemicals. Yeah, it doesn't to me, but you know. And then I also got, oh, he doesn't know I got him a brownie. He doesn't know that. It's a surprise. A pickle. I feel like it's a pack of cigarettes. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this. Ooh. Daniel? Should I get a pickle? Yes. Off camera comes Danny oh, with no. a pickle. Wait, wait. Hang on. We have a tradition. Yeah. You know that? Me and your dad? Pickles? Yep. We, we touch our pickles. Yeah. <laughs> oh. No judge. Mm. One eternity later. All right, we are all set and ready to go. Everybody's now relaxing. Woo! Somebody's doing yeah. their drawing. Go Let's take a look at the front. See how it came out. We got our sign up there so they know where to find us. There we go. We got the prints set up, some sketch covers, well, some fun sketch covers I've done, some sketches people can buy for commission. The last few copies of our current comic book, some sketch cards, and some, I forget what those are called, like rhinestone or diamond art that my wife made. Like Carrie made those and last year we sold out. We'll see how we do this year. But we are already right in IOC for a C real soon. What do you think? How's that look? Yep. Now we just gotta wait for them to let people in. What do you oh you're not throwing that away yet. Why don't you look at this? I come over to throw this away. I got trash, basura, and recycling. What is that? Recycler? Recycler? Mm -hmm. I don't know, but look at this. Trash. Yeah. Um, Recycle. It's the same bag. It's the same thing. <laughs> okay. I just showed Daniel something I want to show you. What's that? What's that? What's that say? The, the, the trash can. Trash or basura? Yeah, and. Recycling. Recycling. Okay, so you have a so you have a plastic bottle. Okay. And you're gonna go put it in there. It's in the same. What the? It's in the same thing. It's in the same thing. There's no divider. There's no divider. What is the point of that? Look. That's. <laughs> right. Oh, okay. he's recycling. Recycling. Oh, he's a rebel. Oh man. All right. So we're all set up. We're gonna take a walk around. Looks like there's all the tables and chairs set up over here. <laughs> Is that one the same thing? We're gonna we're gonna check them. You can take a phone call. It's fine. But they got all the tables and chairs set up for the dining area. It looks like one side's open. I don't know if they're open yet. So we're just gonna we just wanna kind of get a quick lay of the land. It, usually the last few years it stayed the same, but you never know. But I want to go out here and see what kind of food trucks they got going on. I know the food trucks aren't open yet, but we'll see what they have. So this is not set up yet, but Voodoo Ranger. That's a beer. They got creamy boy. <laughs> hey, is that a? Hey, I was, Is that a food truck or what's that all about? <laughs> creamy boys. You got a food truck? No, we're not a food truck. What are you? We'll step inside and we'll let you know. Uh, creamy boys yeah. and fat boys. Creamy boys and fat boys. Fat but see, at least boys. that says catering, so that's good. And then we got here, what's this place? Stop by Cafe. They got, well, I don't know if they have. We got here, Cali Caribbean. Ooh, quesadillas, tacos. 
Oh, these are banh mi. Oh, I got, oh, nice. West side banh mi, lobster melt, brisket. Fusion and grill. That's cool. And then rice balls of fire. Obviously, no, some of her, some of them are open. Not all of them. I, I, if I didn't have that sandwich, I might get something. So those are the food trucks outside. That's cool. Now we're just gonna walk around, see what else is going on. Artist Alley. Almost everybody set up. Yeah. Look at all these mystery boxes. Action uh -huh. Right? Is this the same is this the same lounge fly setup from yeah. Comic Con? I think it's similar, yeah. No, I think it's this no I don't know if it's the same building or not, yeah. And here are the people waiting. And this is Friday. This isn't even this this isn't even a Saturday, you know? Look at that. Look at everybody. Just held up, waiting to get in. The masses. Yeah. We got the security checkpoint over here because I want to make sure no one's sneaking in any hot dogs. I want a hot dog. <laughs> I know, right? Are you hungry? I can eat a hot dog. A hot dog or something else? Like a bigger hot dog? Because, oh, okay. Yeah. Welcome to LA Comic Con. Oh, um, I think that says Comic Con. Of course, I get it where it's blocking it. Let me get over here. There it is. Look at that. Ooh. Hey, wait, look, look, look. Hang on. Look. Oh, look at that. Look at that. They actually have separate ones. They're not the same. They're actually. We found it. Found the one that's actually separate. Can't get in. Can't get in. We can't get in. He's all sad. Look at this. Oh, they're VIPs. No. Are they, is that the VIP? Yeah, the VIP. So the VIP they let in early. Would you always just up there said like wave them in? Huh? Just wave them in. Yeah. Yeah. These are cool. Like, what are those wood? Well, you'd like that Superman. Look at the Superman one. This hot topic setup is awesome. Look at that. Now I remember for Christmas. That is cool. And that's the. This is the queue. All the way down there, weaving through it. It's like you're at a in a queue for a, a ride. That's cool. So look at those trees. They got the holidays set up in a circle. That is really awesome. Way to take it to the next level. That's cool. It is cold in there. I know it's cold outside, but that makes the inside cold too with the air conditioning. Um, I gotta get my jacket for the car. It's cold. All right, that's better. I don't need that. I don't mind that I'm wearing shorts, but it's just the arms. I need something up here. Is it weird to wear a jacket when you're wearing shorts? I don't know, I think it's weird, so like, if you were cold, why, why didn't you wear pants, but it's LA. I thought it was going to be nice, and it was going to be so cold, but now I'm going to go outside and find me a delicious snack, a treat, a bacon-wrapped hot dog. It is certainly uh, lively out here. It feels more, more like Las Vegas when you're out here like this. There's still not enough to do, but it's still cool. Now where do you go? Who do you pick? There's so many. I don't know who to pick. Who looks like they have the crispiest bacon? That's what I want. The one with the crispiest bacon. Now we got the hot dogs. Get them inside. 
chow down. There was a time they wouldn't even let you bring the food in from outside. Of course, the hot dogs are in the pocket, so maybe they just didn't check. Oh, I can't wait to seek my teeth into one of those hot dogs. There it is. What do you think of the mustard game? Very good. <laughs> Oh my god, I didn't get in my pocket. That's what I'm saying. Look at this. This is so good. I got a fist bump from God. <laughs> mm. I tried to find the one. I walked around and looked at them. And I tried to find the one with the crispiest looking bacon. Now, I say this a lot, mm -hmm. don't get me wrong, I love fleas, but come to LA, you gotta have a bacon wrap hot dog. They're letting people in, it's getting fun, it's getting busy. Look at all these people. That's the end of day one. Ooh. What'd you think? It's fun. You got a lot of signatures. I did. Is that the one thing we're not, we don't, I didn't record anything, but he kept leaving to get uh, signatures. Um, yeah, it was, it was fun. I did a couple of sketches. We sold some stuff. Not too bad. But um, yeah, looking forward to tomorrow. Saturday is the, the big day. Woo! We'll see what, how that goes. That's a full day. This was just, what was it? 3.30 to 9. Yeah, it's just yeah. It's still kind of a full day, but later. Well, it's a full day for us because we, we got there early to set up. But yeah, Saturday coming up next. Woo. All right, it is 7 a.m. We're still cleaning stuff out from our eyes. Actually, it's almost 7.45, and we're on our way to the convention center for day two of LA Comic Con. Let's get in the car and go. Ooh. It is Saturday. Now, they don't let people until 9.30, but the VIPs over there get it at 9. And this is what we're dealing with on Saturday. Considerably more people in the pens than yesterday. They all look happy and excited to be here. <laughs> this is gonna be fun day. So I just went across the street real quick to get a couple of waters. I ran out of waters. I got other sodas, like some diet sodas and some lemonades for Ambrose. But I had to get some water. I want water. Um, but yeah, it's really quiet right now. Not too soon before they open. Yeah, that's the main stage. I like how they do that. They have the. Main stage set up here, people load in, you can see what's going on, you don't have to worry about, you know, getting in line and like hoping you get to see it. You know, because everybody fills in here. One year actually, where Lids is, you can see that right over there. Uh, they, they had a different setup and Artist Alley was over here. My table was right on the end there. And so every time they did something on the main stage, People would just fill in right in front of my table. It was great if they bought something, but most of them didn't. But I, I got to watch them when they bring Stan Lee out, like every half hour on the, or every half hour, every hour, I can't remember. They would bring Stan Lee out like every hour. And he'd just say, hey everybody, welcome to Kamikaze, or LA, or then it was uh, Stan Lee's LA Comic Con. And yeah, he'd come out on stage, he'd wave, and you go in the back. And then sometimes he would come on and introduce somebody for a panel. But yeah, like this setup right here, 
that's where my table was. <laughs> so now they moved our Sally all the way down, way down there. Which is cool to have a separate section. Plus, you know, it's more relaxing. We still get a lot of people, but not just people stand there watching the show. But that's, yeah, that's the main stage right there. And a bunch of vendors down there. But now I gotta make my way all the way over to um, my table and artist out. So I got a um, sketch cover commission by Mr. Mises uh, with a twist. So let's see what the twist is. that for that. So what they asked for was they wanted a Mr. Meesex cover and then uh, they asked him, can you hold a, uh, a knife? I was like, what a knife? Like, what kind of knife? You know, he the person yeah. that, that he was getting for, like Punchline. Like, oh, okay. Do you want me to maybe draw Meesex kind of like dressed like Punchline? Like, that was great. So that's how it turned out. So we got... Um. Me six. Like we focus. Me six. Kind of punchline inspired. And then I was on the back. I do a little sketch of the point to do the little Jerry. I was gonna draw him as Joker, so I drew a tie. But then I realized uh, I didn't do the hair right. So anyway, so that's a nice commission cover there. That was fun. Hi, Mr. Me six. Look at me. I'm punchline. Anyway, on to the next one. So sometimes I'm tasked uh, with doing a jam piece. I've been asked a few times to do that where they have a cover or a drawing where they have other characters drawn by other um, artists and then they ask you to draw something. So uh, this gentleman came up to me and he had a, he asked me yesterday about characters and he had, so he had this, uh, uh, trying this here, Superior Foes of Spider-Man and he had an artist do, um, as you can see, their um, Electro and Sandman, and he tasked me with doing Dr. Octopus, who's my, my favorite of the Sinister Six, and then he asked me to do Vulture too, so that's my contribution. So I did Vulture and Doc Ock, I threw in a little claw there. The hard part was he tasked me with figuring out where where the other people were gonna go. Like, he wanted Doc Ock here and Vulture right above him, but it wouldn't work. So I kind of did a little thing like this, so now he has room to put the other two here. I think it's a, um, Mysterio and Craven. Who are the other Sinister Six? Is it Mysterio? What? Lizard. Lizard. And so Lizard and Mysterio. You gotta give enough room for Mysterio and his dome. But yeah, so there's that. They're not pretty good. It, it puts pressure on me because I draw very cartoony, but uh, whoever did this right here did such a good job. I tried to I tried to kind of do the same kind of kind of style. I don't want it to stand out too much like I didn't want to do cartoony. So, yeah. I hope he likes it when he gets it. happy with their Young Justice sketch. They asked for Tim Drake doing the heart signs. So, a little creative. It was supposed to be just a headshot, but I figured I'll, I'll incorporate the hand heart sign into it. So there we go. So that's another day in the books. Woo. Right? When we leave, I didn't think I showed you this before. We just cover everything up. Just cover it up, go, and come back the next day. Tomorrow's gonna be the fun day. Because it's break down and pack up. Yay. And then carry the, wait for the elevator or carry the stuff down uh, the stairs. No, I'm waiting for the elevator. After last time, I'm waiting for the elevator. No, it's still too long of a line. I don't give up. Better you than that, probably. You didn't have to carry anything. We carried it. What are you talking about? It was about? a struggle watching you guys go down Yeah, the it, hurt, it hurts your back just watching yes. it. Yes. All right. Well, don't look. Look at this hat I bought, guys. It's cool, huh? It's I have not. 
It's one piece. I haven't watched all 1,593 episodes. She wants me to wear these. You got it, you got it. Woo! How's that? Can you see? Uh, cat ears. And Ambrose is so proud of his father. Yep. Wearing cat ears. Yep, gotta say it. Ooh -ooh. Yeah, I'm gonna wear them from now on. Uh, you can't even see them in the dark. There you go. Look at that. Nice. <laughs> All right, it's about eight o'clock in the morning. I'm walking down the main aisle of Los Angeles Comic Con. You can see the banners up there. Making my way over to the sea aisle, Artist Alley. Get stuff ready for the last day of the show, Sunday. Sundays are always fun. Well, all the days are fun. I like them all. But uh, Sundays are fun if you're walking around. You can watch uh, dealers like lowering prices on stuff. Uh, <laughs> Daniel didn't buy uh, a certain Superman statue because he saw the sticky note on it with the price. But the price was written a little high on the sticky note, like location-wise. So it's like he knew that the guy had written it high so on Sunday he could line it out and write the lower price below it. <laughs> See? Experience. Anyway, yeah. Um, Ambrose and Melissa are in the car because they're so tired so they were gonna take a nap. But yeah, I'm gonna, so I'm gonna go set up and be ready for all the wonderful attendees at LA Comic Con. So I just finished this Vegeta sketch. It is for these gentlemen here. He he asked for he said it's for his son, so I'm expecting to give it to like a little kid. But no. <laughs> But there you go. There so there you go. And you and you walked up when I was finishing it, and you said uh, Vegeta. So I I guess I got it right. Yep. See now you guys will be in the video. You got right. it right, baby. <laughs> thank you. Thanks for stopping by, guys. I really appreciate yeah, thank it. Thank you for for the freebies, man. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> thank you. Everybody's leaving. Everybody's packing up. This is what it looks like after a show. It's 6:06. Uh, um, show is over at five. Yep. We would have been done uh, sooner, but uh, he was helping uh, one of our friends pack up, and then I started talking to people, um, saying uh, goodbye. Uh, but look at we got it. This is our whole table that you saw earlier all packed in those uh, two little bins. Um, so now we're going to wheel out where there's usually a huge line for the elevator, but we're gonna take the stairs. <laughs> so we're gonna lift these little, these uh, bins there, and then we're going to take them on the stairs. One at a time. Hopefully we don't trip, or I don't trip. Because we won't have it on camera, because we're not running the camera on the And that is it. Everything's in the car, everything's ready to go. Melissa's ready to go, Amber's ready to go, are we ready to just go home or go eat? Eat. 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 Eat, okay. So yeah, let's close up and let's hit the button. There we go. Now the drive. So we are out of the city now. We're closer to home. They're gonna go in. We're gonna go have some food here at Portillo's, one of our favorite places. And um, yeah, it was fun uh, last three days at LA Comic Con. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, what are we gonna do? We're gonna like, we're gonna subscribe, and we're gonna click the bell for notifications. All right, thanks for watching everybody. Have fun, and I'll see you in the next video.